What's up everyone? Today I'm going to shoot these 3D printed bullets sent by Sonoran Flight Club. Second time they send me ammo to test out. First time with some whistling bullets and this time it's more of an aerodynamic shape with a sort of propeller looking shape within them. He sent me four different sizes. Two relatively large ones with different diameters and two of the same diameters smaller. One is more dense than the other. So I'm gonna see how fast they can go. I'm gonna shoot at this plywood target over there. I'll be using a 30 inch primal sling. So now I'm gonna measure my distance to the target to see how far I'm shooting from. 18.2 meters, that's how far I am. They are beautiful, that's for sure. Let's see how fast they can go. So first one is gonna be this fat looking one. Big curve downwards. Let's see. This is what they look like in the pouch. All right, I'm gonna try a dance one. Maybe they'll fly better. Definitely better. All right, the light ones, this is another light one. They don't work so well. Let's see if I can actually not. For some reason, they're curving straight down to the ground. Uh, I think the the Magnus effect, maybe, is just driving them around. Dancer projectile. All right, I hit it. Went through the plywood. That's a good one for speed measurements. Let's try again. They definitely fly straighter and it's definitely easier to get them on target. Nice. One more. Let's see. All right. Okay, let's see what a river stone does as a reference compared to the other bullets to see if we can get some speeds out of this too. All right.
my GoPro was not turned on, so I don't think I'm gonna get the measurement for this one, unfortunately. That's it, they're gone. Oh wait, I've got one more here. One more dense one, and see what happens. All right. All right, now I'm gonna shoot some river stones. Got one in. Okay, Riverstone, let's see how fast it can go. All right, very small one. Whew, that feels good. came out wrong and hit the the real barrel all right I'm done <laughs> <laughs>